All right, guys, today I'm gonna show you how to refill your Cigar Oasis. This particular model is the Cigar Oasis XL 3.0. As you can see, my humidity is at 69, which is almost perfect, but that can vary depending on what kind of cigars you're trying to store. Um, this one reads temperature, you can see my set point, but there's basically a few easy steps and we'll have this refilled. So as you can see here, I unplugged the Cigar Oasis just for the sake of this video. However, I'll show you where the plug goes when I place the Cigar Oasis back into my humidor. So to get the top piece off, you're going to want to apply pressure here. You're going to hear a pop noise. Then you can take the top piece off, which has all your controls on it. Now the bottom piece has a sponge, and this is where you're going to insert your distilled water. You're going to want to use distilled water because regular tap water can cause bacteria and mold to form on the sponge. So in this glass here, I have some distilled water. This is way more than you'll ever need. However, this is just to show you guys. So you're gonna wanna pour the distilled water into the holes without making a mess, as you can see. And that will fill and you will eventually see it come out both sides of the holes. Now, at that point, you can stop. And what I like to do is get a paper towel or a couple paper towels. And you're gonna wanna place them down and then pour out the excess and eventually flip it upside down so that there's no more water coming out of these holes. Once you have all the water cleaned up, you're ready to put the top piece back onto the base. Now to do this, you're gonna to wanna to place it on, you feel it fit into the grooves, and then on the opposite end from what you took it off on, you're gonna to wanna to apply pressure and you'll hear another pop noise, and then you know that your top piece is correctly on the bottom. So now that we have our Cigar Oasis full, we can now plug it in. As before, I explained that there's a plug. Now this plug comes with a ribbon cord, so it's actually able to fit inside your seal of your humidor. Uh, this is what the plug looks like. Here's where it goes. Now this is gonna be hard to do with one hand, but we'll give it a shot. Just put it in, press. After a few seconds, your cigar oasis will come back on. It always reads um, differently in the beginning and then it'll come back to normal. And that's basically it. Once you have it full and plugged in, you can put it back into your humidor and you're good to go. So as you can see, that really wasn't that hard. There's not many steps to it. Um, and once you fill it, uh, it lasts a pretty long time. So you don't really have to worry about it. The only thing you might want to do is check your humidity from time to time just to make sure it doesn't spike. Uh, I never really had that issue, but um, if you guys enjoyed the video, let me know if you can subscribe and uh, maybe comment if you guys want to see some other things cigar related. Thank you.